Hi there everyone, I'm Lori Baracco and I am so grateful for all of you that trusted me with my intuitive guidance and messages to listen to my weekly predictions. And I did want to mention that this upcoming week on Tuesday, July 2nd, we have two events. We have a new moon and we have a total solar eclipse, both taking place on the same day. I've written a blog article and I put a link here in the description of, the, of this week's predictions. So if you're finding yourself in a little bit of uh, a quandary and if the poop has been hitting the fan could be that the that the shadowy side of things your life uh, your relationships and your situations are kind of coming up to the surface for you to look at and to do some inner reflection inner inner reflection and yes also outer reflection as to to kind of investigate why why is this happening why is this coming um, into my field of awareness. What's going on? What can I shift? And which seeds do I want to plant in this time of cancer? Cancer is a, is that homebody, that nurturing, loving, sensitive cheerleader, and um, is uh, and home life. That home base is so important to cancers. All right, so I'm going to select three cards from my Gilded Royal, Gilded Royale Tarot by Sarah Marchetti. All right, so let's see, in addition to those astrological events, what else is coming up for us? What else can we keep our eyes peeled for? What other element? So I'm gonna pull three from the top. All right, so. Spirit is going to assist us with bringing forth the courage, the strength, the, the chutzpah, uh, the nerve to the assertiveness, assertive, to bring forward assertiveness to help us tend to the things that need tending to. So we'll find our power. We'll step even more so into our power. Our throat chakras are going to be nice, strong, solid, and, and we'll be able to communicate what it is that we need to communicate, not just with others, but with ourselves as well. It's time for us to make those executive decisions and really take a, take a look at what's going on in our lives. If we don't like something, it's up to us to fix it, to do something. We can't just sit here and complain about the universe doing this and and blame it on blaming it on uh the retrogrades which is coming up as well Mer mercury will be retrograde again soon it's not it, it, those are excuses right so if something is manifesting in our lives there's no one to point the finger at except for us because we allow things to happen we allow things to continue so we have the strength card which is where i see that courage it's like come on get in there and take care of it you have to do it. No one can do it for you. The next one is the Six of Pentacles reversed. So this is where we're not quite an equal exchange of energy and intention with what we want and desire and with what's happening. So time to shift things and change it up. And then we have the Star reverse. So um, <laughs> it's like Spirit saying, no more finger pointing, no more blaming external influences. They made me do it. It's because of, and I don't have any other choices. I'm limited in what I can do. Uh-uh, that's not gonna fly this week because Spirit's like, oh yeah, you think that? Well, here, bam, slam. Here are more uh, situations where they're connected with what you're not taking care of in your life. So no more outside blaming, no more pointing the fingers, point that finger back this way and do something about it. And by the way, it doesn't have to be this whole big brouhaha, this all this chaos that's that's taking place. Just tend to it. And you don't need to dramatize it, right? Things, A lot of things are black and white. It's like it's this or not. You don't need to add all the other excuses and the, the being a martyr and so on and so forth. Just get in there, clean it up and plant new seeds. Alrighty, everyone, I'm Lori Baracco and I look forward to seeing you soon. Namaste.